kingdom. So we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. <laughs> yeah, sure, Alonzo. Yeah, I'm super hated, eh, by the way. There's people that have a, they, 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 they've been doing this to me for four years. You know that they, uh, they, they call me a pedophile. They, they go that far. They, I was mentoring young boys cause I love men. I men, men's ministry is, is cause I feel my bros. I love my bros. Okay. Um, no homo, but I love my bros. Okay. And, uh, I'm mentoring a young boy. These sick people would take the picture of me and the young boy and accuse me of pedophilia. No joke. I had to have the moms contact YouTube and everything to, to, to attack them. They're, yeah, Patrick, you know who they are. They're actually sick, disgusting. They're probably watching. You guys are probably watching. You're, you're actually that upset. They're obsessed with me. I'm totally serious, by the way, guys, okay? YouTube has taken down this one channel. Don't even mention his name. But he had over 400 videos, and when YouTube finally pulled the plug, he was calling me a reptilian, a Freemason, everything he could make up, because the guy's delusional. The guy is obviously not in his right mind. And then he went as far as making accusations of pedophilia, which I would never do. Oh, man, I, I'm sorry, but if ever I met that guy in real life, pray for me, faith family, that I don't end up in jail for beating the living daylights out of someone. Okay, because that one is, whoo, whoo, and he's a fat, out of shape old man that I would just, oh, anyways, I'm not going to try and go there. But this sick, twisted human being, sick and twisted, deranged, demented, demon possessed human being. Oh, oh, bud, you're lucky you live far, I'm telling you, and, and I never see you in person. <sighs> You can, you can say I'm false, but when you start going into that place, that kind of false accusation, oh my goodness, man. Oh, I'm real, guys. You, you don't think I want to... Hey, you ever get called a pedophile? How would that make you feel if, if you were publicly defamed in front of thousands of people publicly all over the internet? And people legitimately think you're a pedophile. And when you join, when you join churches, they call those churches to tell the, the people there that they have a pedophile on hand. How would you? I'm human, guys. I'm human. And the old Mario was a fighter, okay? I was a scrapper. That's all I did. Okay? How would you feel? I'm human. I'm, I'm, I'm transparent, okay? I'd like to say that you can call me a pedophile and there's no urge for me not to just pound your face in. But of course, I'm a human. So, I want someone to get a message to Mario. I want Mario to see this. If you in Indiana come and see me at this Bible prophecy conference exposing the darkness in May, check the de link for details right here. Wired Coffee House and Music Venue, Evansville, Indiana. Mario, I want to tell you something. Evansville's a good uh, two hours, hour and a half. from Louisville, where I am. Now I imagine you're going to have to fly into Louisville to get here, because I honestly don't think Evansville is big enough to have a, uh, a big enough to have a real airport to get somewhere like Toronto. And it takes forever and a day to get there from Indianapolis. I know it says there's an interstate right here, but it honestly stops, like, uh, just randomly. It doesn't actually go through. It stops in Bloomington, so it's going to be a little bit uh, of a hassle. You also, I also say you're flying from uh, St. Louis. 
But honestly, Louisville's a lot closer. If you've got the nerve, come to Louisville. And we'll settle this. Let's settle this. If not, if you're too chicken to come to Louisville, and you come to Evansville, and you make me pay, uh, how much was it? Let's see, uh, 45 minutes. You make me pay, what is it, $45, $30 for early registration? $40 for late registration? You make me pay that? And plus I have to get a rental car? You ain't gonna like it, buddy. You ain't gonna like it at all. You ain't gonna like what I have to do. Someone make sure Mario sees this. If you come into my neck of the woods, hit me up. We'll talk. Won't even record it. So why no tears, watch this, no tears. So I gotta make the judgment call, guys, and um I gotta get myself well. Um A little while ago, um, was a good brother in the Lord who, um, you know, obviously he cared, and he gave me advice to, uh, come off my medicine. You know, uh, the doctor prescribed mood, uh, stabilizing medicine for me. Um, no tears. He's got that Johnson and Johnson. No tears. Now I want you to know something right here. This is him saying he's canceling out. Okay. No somebody says this is his conference. What conference was that? There's one out there in Evansville, about two hours from me. He's pussing out on the one on meeting me face to face. I knew he wasn't going to show up. That's why I didn't make any real plans to go. I knew he wasn't going to show up. I'd like to say that you can call me a pedophile and there's no urge for me not to just pound your face in. But of course, I'm a human. That's, that's insane to go to that level. It's illegal, by the way. It's a criminal act, okay, with no evidence. Oh, their evidence is diluted evidence because they just twist it all up and, and make up false stuff. And they, they take a picture and go, oh, see, look at this picture. He's, he has his hand around the guy. I'm mentoring the kid. They're malicious and twisted. They called they called Jesus um, not a pedophile, but they called him a devil, and they they called him a drunkard, and they called him all that. Okay. So, anyways, I'm gonna chill. Okay. But these are the things that I deal with. Okay. By the way, faith family. Okay. That's 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 an added thing to to this whole thing that I'm doing. OK, I got to deal with stuff like that to serve, to be out here and to put myself out. I have to deal with these kind of devils and they're not going to go away. They're not going to stop. They're so I, I've dealt with it. I tried to to expose them and deal with their lies. Now I will never I'll never address them by name. I'll never talk about them because they're sick and uh, I don't want to they feed into that. They, they love it when you publicly talk about their name and then they, they get all they get that. OK, but um so when you're like, oh, look, he's got this great, amazing thing going on with YouTube. You don't, you don't see the whole picture, bud. You don't see the whole picture of stuff that I deal with to do this, okay? So exactly, I'm not going to let them get me upset, and we're not going to talk about that anymore, but I do deal with demented 
satanic and they call themselves christians too that's the twisted part these are people who try and be christian but if you were to look at their channel all they do is attack christians they don't preach the gospel they don't help anyone they don't bless anyone they just expose 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 most of them are satanist undisguised by the way okay satanist loves to do that they love to pretend to be a christian and then under the disguise of a christian all they do is attack the credibility of real christians okay so anyways it's actually a good thing that YouTube got a little bit serious about the uh, policies. Uh, in one sense, it hurt me because I, you know, there's no more free speech. But at least now, YouTube, when it comes to the flip side of it, is they actually now are taking down channels that do this, and and rightfully so. So they are cracking down on actual bullying and actual defamation and libel, which is a crime. So uh, it's been good because they, I couldn't believe for years they let this channel go on and the, it was like the Mario Exposed channel. It was more than 300 videos. All his videos were about me and everything. So anyways, okay. That's it. No, we're not gonna talk about it. I knew it wasn't. And this whole bipolar stuff, Because <laughs> it's been hard, man, no and um, I'm just done. So, um, <laughs> no tears. I wanted to make this video. Um, if you're someone who suffers from stuff like this um anxiety depression panic bipolar one two whatever you know the enemy really attacks your mind um and you're at a point where you're trying to keep on going in life and you're trying to keep everything going but you're not good and you need to stop i want you to stop right now and get the help you need okay just stop what you're doing okay stop trying to keep it together just go get the help that you need okay that's what i'm gonna do and there's times where people just have to understand that that we're not well and we need to take care of ourselves hey everyone so, you're doing well wanted to uh go ahead and record I'm gonna this keep video you guys posted to encourage on, your uh, my Christ recovery here today. and ah! how well i'm doing because right now it's not good <laughs> and um I'm, I'm tired of this i'm really <sighs> You know, I want God to do something with this, either to heal it or allow me to glorify him in this weakness and really just, uh, you know, be healthy. <laughs> Still so, um, I'm really, really sorry, guys. No tears. That I can't make the conference. Oh, there's, 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 he's trying. He's probably got that little red eye stuff. <laughs> but I gotta get it together. I went to the library yesterday. I got some books and stuff.